Everything's going on, guys. Six days before Christmas vlogmas. Let's go. Bring this open. It is still snowy out. A lot of the snow is going to melt today, though. That's sad. Very really sad. I think there's like a 40% chance of snow slash rain, mostly rain probably, on Christmas. I'm praying it snows on Christmas. I don't think I've ever had a snowy Christmas in my life. That's like my dream come true. If we do have a snowy Christmas, hopefully it's in like the morning and stuff. So uh, yeah, I'm about to go watch some hype mic, get some Burger King. Let's get it, boys. Guys, today's video is sponsored. I'm kidding, it's not sponsored. But we got this new order and it's from this company called Hara Ornaments. It's pretty cool. And as you can see, it's Michael Myers ornament. We got it the other day. Um, it got sent to us. And we bought it. Oh, he's right here. He fell over. So I'll stand this, stand this guy up lurking in the trees. There he is. Yes, this is another bloody knife, this white mask. It's a great quality. It's really nice. It's really nice. Mm-hmm. Fries and a chicken sandwich. Let's go. So I'm sitting up here at the desk and I just built on some of my Minecraft world. And I'm actually about to go eat a cheeseburger probably soon so uh yeah let's uh turn my hair on this freddy there's foxy all right let's go i'm tired i don't know what to do i'm probably gonna do a taste test on these chips or something but for now, I'm gonna lay down. Hey. Hey. Hi. Alright, y'all, I'm gonna show you how to make the best cup of coffee. Hot cocoa or hot chocolate, ever. First, these are the ingredients you're gonna need. You need some graham crackers, some, a cinnamon stick, some pumpkin spice, and some whipped cream, and obviously your hot chocolate. Make sure you cook your hot chocolate, put it in a mug, or whatever you want. Obviously, if you really want, you could do it like that, but that's just kinda boring. We're gonna, we're gonna kinda make it, we're gonna make it good. So, let me just get this. You're gonna wanna take your whipped cream if I can get it. Hold on, guys. Get your whipped cream. And once you have your whipped cream, you're gonna wanna shake it. Then you are going to want to. Okay, let me just. Hopefully, that's pretty good. You're gonna wanna. Make sure it's covering it. There you go. Whipped cream like that. Then you're gonna want to take graham crackers. Open those up. Get just one graham cracker to be good. These are the best graham crackers. Break it up into small little bits. Put those in. No, I'm gonna add a little more. Okay. There we go. Break it into little bits. Put it in. There you go. Take your pumpkin spice, I've never used this before, so I'm just gonna, how you open it? There we go. 
it's a lot, so I'm gonna put some on a napkin. That should be a good amount right there. Just put that on there. Next, if you really want to get really fancy with it, take a cinnamon stick, stick that right in there, and you have yourself the best hot chocolate you could ever want. Make sure to take graham crackers. Mm -mm -mm -mm. You can have as, add as much or little as you want. Thank you. Bye. Be careful, guys. Make sure to get those graham crackers out before they get completely submerged because we can have wicked soggy stuff, so make sure to eat them first with the whipped cream and the hot chocolate. So, I mean, a really good snack. I've already eaten a bunch of it. To dump graham cracker in. Only put it in for a little. Even that was wicked soggy. But the crushed up graham cracker on top is really good. And this cinnamon stick. Oh my god, it's so good. You can use this to stir it around. Just give it that flavor. Put that in there. You can get that completely submerged because that's how you get the flavor out. I'm going to go enjoy myself by a fire and eating this. <sighs> Alright guys, key note to that. Honestly, I wouldn't add the cinnamon stick. It doesn't taste that good with it. I'll just say that right now. Alright, bye.